RSD Research Special Division is based in the Fender Custom Shop and is focused on developing, inventing, and creating cutting-edge components for all guitars and basses. Our team in RSD knows no boundaries when coming up with the new designs. There is only what if, or why can't we? It's not chained to the norm or what we've always done. The intent is to push the envelope, come up with totally new designs, and improve the performance of a musical instrument. The first two designs are the RSD Telecaster Bridge and the RSD High Mass Bass Bridge. This is just the beginning. There are many more designs for bridges, both Fender and non-Fender instruments. Pickups, knobs, body materials, etc. The sky's the limit for us. These bridges will first be used on Fender Custom Shop products for 2013 and then be available as replacement parts through our accessories department so that everybody has an opportunity to upgrade their instrument. Hi, my name is Scott Buell. I'm with Fender Custom Shop and I'm here today to talk to you a little bit about the new RSD Bass Bridge. Okay, the design process for this bridge was very drawn out, took a long time, had a lot of different versions and kept boiling it down and boiling it down until we came up with this. It had to be uh, aesthetically pleasing, it had to be a design that would be easy to manufacture so we can keep the price down. It went easy, I'm saying um, we're going to machine it out of a solid billet on a CNC mill. So not a lot of different setups, not a lot of 3D. Uh, we modeled it in the computer and dialed it in, got everything to fit where it needs to go. Um, we're able to recess the string balls and all the screws and make everything nice and tight and when we were happy with it uh, we cut some and they came out very nice so we're very pleased with this bridge. This would be considered a high mass bridge and this bridge we decided we we're going to make it out of brass and it was a solid billet to begin with and we machined it um, as opposed to having a casting no zinc or anything and we were careful about the alloy that we chose and uh, actually where we, where we left material on and where we took material away to achieve the sound that we wanted, but without making a bridge that was just heavy for nothing. So we, we like the bass to be as uh, comfortable as possible to play, but still have the strings anchored in a nice high mass block. The material we settled on for this bridge is a brass alloy. There are a lot of different materials to choose from, even just many in the uh, brass family. So after some trial and error, we arrived at something we were happy with. With this first one, we're giving the option to string it through the body, uh, string it top loader style, and a lot of guys in the shop that are using it will do a combination. They like to play with the feel and with the sound, so that gives you some options. In addition to this version of the bridge that fits our American Standard line, we're also producing a five-hole configuration that will fit both the P-Bass and the Jazz Bass. The five-hole bridge will be strictly top loader, so if you're in the market for a high-mass bridge, this is the one. 